Hello friends, welcome to Dial Android YouTube channel. Uh, today I will show you how to install Mi ROM on Galaxy Mini or Galaxy Pop. Both are the same, S5570 model number. Uh, first let me show you in which uh, firmware I am running on now. This is official stock firmware and uh, it's a gingerbread so make sure you have updated your phone to gingerbread before proceeding to install. And the second thing you need to have Clockwork mod installed on your phone. For that, uh, please uh, visit our Android YouTube channel in the website. You will find a solution for it. It's just a two-minute process. So, to install that, first download the files given in, uh, given on the blog and paste it on your uh, internal SD card. Uh, let me show you. I have already downloaded the files. So here is the file. One is the main file, and the second one is the patch. So. Now you have to switch off your phone and boot it into CWM mode. To do that you have to press the home button and the power button together and leave the power button as soon as you see the Samsung logo. Yes. So here you go. You have the seat clockwork mark recovery menu. Yeah. So first of all what you have to do is you have to wipe data and factory reset okay i will click on yes so formatting is done now wipe cache partition that's also complete now go to the advanced delvic cache that's also wiped battery status wiped so now go to the install zip from sd card and locate the file uh, where you have pasted those two zip files so first I will install this beta 3 file and then the patch so here we go installation will take little time you can see the progress here so it's done so now I will do the patch for, uh, install the patch file also mm, this one is the patch file ok now yes that's it ok so the installation is done now I'll go back and reboot the system now. No finger crossed. Let's see. I have tested this ROM already, so it works pretty good. And obviously, the Mi ROM is one of the most beautiful, beautiful ROMs ever. This is the first boot, so it will take little time. If you are holding the device, you will feel a little vibrate uh, once the setup is complete and it will boot. Here you go, you can see the Mi logo. This is based on Cyanogen mod only, so there might be few bugs, but as of now, I think uh, it's working fine. This is a gingerbread of uh, version of me, not the ICS version, so by this time, most, most of the bugs are gone, so you can use it for daily use.
I got the vibrate. This is the first boot up, so it will take time. You have to be very patient before removing the battery and redoing the process. It takes around four or five minutes. So yeah. Now I have uh, got the initial setup thing. Okay. Here you go. So this is the MIUI ROM on our Galaxy Mini. Okay, so I don't like this shadow, so I'll switch this shadow off first. To go to the personal desktop effect icon shadow. Yeah. So now you can see more clearly. So this is uh, me gingerbread ROM on Galaxy Pop or Galaxy Mini. It's working very fine. You can see there is no lag in the system. Yeah, yeah. Here is the detailed version. And you can see all the Cyanogen mod settings. So it's as I already told you, it's based on Cyanogen mod. But the phone works pretty good. You can see the lock screen. You have the dialer and the messaging, and you the same the effects and the call dialer. It's, everything works perfectly. You have the different toggles which you can configure also. So it's a daily use ROM. You can use it properly. There's no issue in that. You can check out the camera also. There you go. So, thanks, my guys. Thanks for watching it. Uh, if you have any doubt, just leave a comment on the blog or YouTube channel. We'll try to help you out. Thank you.